In this video series, we hope to empower our users with short bits of information they may find useful in the day-to-day -day use of their Toshiba product. Have you ever needed to capture some information displayed on the PC screen? Today's tip is how to capture a picture of the whole PC screen or just a part of the PC screen. Here are a few ways to do just that. The most common way is to use the print screen button on the keyboard. On some keyboards, you may need to hold the FN button while pressing the print screen button. This will take a picture of the current screen contents for you to paste into your favorite image editing program. However, did you know that holding down the Alt key while pressing the print screen button will only take a picture of the active window on the screen? For example, say you have two open windows, as shown in our example. If you only press the print screen key, it'll take a screen capture, or picture, of the entire desktop, as well as the two open windows. Instead, if you hold down the Alt key and press the print screen key, it'll only take a picture of the active window. In this example, because the active window was the web browser, it only captured the window with the browser. This could save you some time by not having to crop your images later. In Windows 8, if you hold down the Windows key and press the print screen button, it'll not only take the screen capture of the screen, but it'll also save it to a file in your pictures folder automatically. If you have Windows 7 or Windows 8, there's an easy-to-use tool named the Snipping Tool that lets you refine your screen captures even further by allowing you to select just the section of the screen you need. You could find the Snipping Tool by searching for it from the Windows 8 Start screen, or if you have Windows 7, using the Search field located in the Start menu. Remember, capturing your screen is just part of the process. Once captured, you must paste the information into whatever document you need to display the information. For example, into a Word document or even a PowerPoint document. For more Toshiba tips and tricks, go to support.toshiba.com.